Hey guys, so today is the grand finale for Aisha Chimugu's 50th birthday. I just want to take you through this island. Um, this is the island where Aisha Chimugu is putting up. I'd like you guys to know that this is the same island where when Melina Gates was going through a divorce, this was where she came to hide because she didn't want any paparazzi. Also, this is the same island where Beyonce came and did her vacation. Um, or so and guess what guys it costs a hundred and fifty thousand dollars to stay here for a night one whole night and it will please you to know that Aisha Achimugu is the first Nigerian woman to stay in this same island guess what a hundred and fifty thousand dollars a night and guess what we've been here for the past Aisha has been here for the past ten days it's our own seventh day today. Man, you guys have to give it to her. Aisha Chumugo. See that yacht over there? That's where we were last night when we had the casino party. Oh god, what's blowing my camera? Yeah, that's where we were last night when we had the casino party. We did it on the yacht. So, we're back here. I'm going to show you guys. Today we're having a breakfast party with Aisha. That's what she wants. She wants everybody here in white. Everybody is in white having breakfast with her I'm gonna come back later and show you guys what everyone looks like this is the entire island see them see my peeps everyone is balling I'm coming right back guys this is J.E.O. The fire and the oven that the creek goes through, when you come out on the other end of it, you will be formed, you will be better, you will be brighter, you will be beautiful, you will be stronger. Amen. Because what doesn't kill you makes you stronger and better. better. Happy birthday, Raja. Happy, happy birthday. Hello Grenada, we're coming on the yacht right now to celebrate tonight. It's a wonderful night, party in the yacht tonight. I Aisha, aka Global Mama Fifi. It's a shutdown in Grenada. Yeah. You know, Becky is an award student, and I can tell you that His Excellency. Dickon Michelle is the youngest. Can we please welcome the youngest Prime Minister, the Prime Minister of Grenada, to please join the birthday girl. I know he's waiting for her. That cake is a peacock. Beautiful peacock.
death is a person, herself, jewel of indestructible value. And she has become the pride of Africa, the pride of the world, as well as Grenada. Can we please welcome her with a bigger round of applause just as she makes her way? Dr. Aisha Achimugu, who attained Grenadian citizenship through the country's Citizenship by Investment program, marked her 50th birthday with a gift, well, gifts to local children. More in this report. Dr. Aisha Achimogo, one of Grenada's newest citizens, celebrated her 50th birthday in a unique and heartwarming way. She chose to give back to her new community by donating over 200 school bags carefully packed with essential school supplies to vulnerable children on the island. Dr. Achimogo, originally from Nigeria, became a Grenadian citizen through the Citizen by Investment Program, which allows individuals to obtain citizenship by making a significant investment in the country's development. Speaking to the media Monday evening, she said it is important for her to give back. I want to thank all Grenadians for accepting me to be one of them. And um, part of what has given me joy in my life is to give back. The world that is own has been very fair to me. God has been extremely fair to me. And the least of what I can do is to give back, which is my greatest joy. This celebration wouldn't have been complete if I didn't have a moment to give back. It's not enough to what I feel and what I want to do. And um, this is just the beginning. It's a home for me, I will always come. And I want to be part of it, or like what I told the Prime Minister, I want to be part of what are the challenges of this country. So in the education and the healthcare, and the women empowerment is what will give me joy. The entrepreneur also stated that five lucky students will be beneficiaries of scholarships offered by her charity organization, SAM, named after her children. Teresa Okeke, Grenadian CBI specialist in introducing Dr. Achimogo, highlighted some of her humanitarian work in Nigeria. She is the MD CEO of Felak Group. It's uh, one of the largest conglomerates uh, in oil, gas, maritime, training, hospital services, any sector that adds value, Dr. Achimugu is there. And excelling as uh, a woman and as a um, just a brilliant entrepreneur. Since she has joined us in Grenada, she wanted to continue the work that she does in Nigeria for us and our citizens. Uh, in Nigeria, she has a foundation called SAM Ackerman, named, named after her three children. And this foundation provides uh, educational support, health care, uh, women's services for across a wide range of uh, needs. Permanent Secretary in the Ministry of Education, Elvis Maureen, gratefully accepted the donated items on behalf of the students. Dr. Aisha, what you have done is very impactful for us at the education sector. And we've always endeavored to, to have benefactors who can contribute to the development of our society. We always see the best gift that we can give to a nation is one of education. So we are very happy. Value, because we believe the best way we can appreciate something is a return gratitude. So we're really happy. So to you and your entire team for your effort, we look forward to working with you. The donation was handed over on Calvini Island on Monday. Rena Pay Thomas, GBN News.